Smith, new coach last year, defensive wizard trying to change over the Bears. Off a bye against Romeo Cornell, a defensive wizard, and his new look Cleveland Brown. Ooh. Thomas Jones ran hard in this game. He knew points would be at a premium 6-3. Cleveland in the third quarter, Jones for 23, Jones for 25 yards. Look at him, change directions, down to the 11. Two plays later on third down, the rookie Kyle Orton. He heard a who? Over to Mark Edwards, eight-yard touchdown, eight a touchdown, and the Bears are in front, ten to six. Scary moment, Chicago. Jones takes a hand up up the middle, tackled awkwardly by Chris Crocker. Jones leaves the game with an injured right knee. So Romeo Cornell talking to Trent Dilfer on the sideline. We're down ten six, so we got about three minutes to go, and Trent goes to Antonio Bryant. What a play at the back of the end zone with just three minutes to go. The 100th TD pass in Dilford's career, and the Browns all of a sudden have the lead. Ensuing possession, it's a foul, foul, and the Browns recover. Adrian Peterson caused. Yeah, Adrian Peterson right there trying to block Chris Crocker on the blitz. Good pickup, except he happened to hit the football, knock it out of his quarterback's hand. Todd Grantham, the defensive coordinator, loves it, and so would everybody else in Cleveland when Dilford. To Bryant again. I mean, that's what, 38 seconds, two touchdowns in a pitcher's duel, and all of a sudden, the Browns and Dilfer go on to win it by the count of 20 to 10. Hey, Cleveland under Romeo Grinnell is two and two, and Dilfer, 100 start. Career touchdown pass number 100 and 101. Yeah, and you look at the numbers on Dilfer, the 23 of 34, 218. Yeah, two interceptions with two touchdowns. Managing this team and maybe doing a little bit more than that for Romeo Cornell. Braylon Edwards, though, out. An infection had to be operated on in his elbow on Saturday night, so we'll have to wait for upcoming.